Uh, we have so many dignitaries uh, here today to help us celebrate. We are so proud to begin the construction of the 520 Bridge right here in Grace Harbor County. Yeah. Uh, it's taken many years and uh, many people to help us get here. And uh, we are so proud that we can begin the construction to replace our vulnerable bridge. It's a windstorm like this that might take it out of play. And so this project will build replacement pontoons for the existing bridge. We have many local workers right here from Grace Harbor working on this project. We're going to have uh, the best pontoon construction site ever right here on this site. We're very pleased and proud to host this project, a very important project. This groundbreaking ceremony is a sign for all Grace Harbor for better times ahead. Let's begin now. And we're very honored to be part of something that I think is a testament when uh, all of this area, we unleash all of our social, our economic and political potential. This community in this region is very capable of delivering some amazing successes. And this project is an example of what this community can do when we come together and leverage our respective natural assets, our human capital. We're very capable and we're quite honored to be here as partners of this amazing project. So thank you, Governor. Thank you to the Grays Harbor community. Um, you've been working with us for a number of years now and today we're going to break ground. Um, this is a major milestone for all of us. It's going to keep Washington State moving to the 21st century. We're going to replace an old and vulnerable floating bridge, the 520, which by wind like this, candidly, or by an earthquake could be taken down and imagine the devastation if that happened. We're in tough times across America and I don't need to tell you that here. We've got over 12 and a half percent unemployment here in this community. So no matter how tough the times are today, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to work here in Aberdeen. Yeah! We're building the, the casting basin here to produce the pontoons, as, as uh, Paula put it, that are going to be honking big. Uh, we're going to start with about 50 workers. At our peak, we'll go to 300. It will be the largest pontoons that anybody here can imagine. we got to come out again on a bright, sunny day and take a look at those. It's a great example of our state coming together, this community helping build the infrastructure for the Puget Sound area. Thank you to Kiwit. Thank you all very much for what you're doing and, and the challenging opportunity that you've taken up here. Thank you again to the people of Grace Harbor who are going to make it happen, to the carpenters and the pile drivers, to the operating engineers, to the concrete and iron workers who will ensure that we have a safe and strong bridge. It really does take skill and determination, and by gum, this is the place to find it. We're up to the challenge here. Uh, these pontoons for the bridge will keep our vital transportation link open for workers, for goods, for services. We're on track uh, to have that new bridge by the end of 2014. Yeah, fill in that hole. Yeah. 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 